He is a very even people person. And uh, that's the first time I've ever seen him go off. The woman you just saw saying that she'd never seen Will do anything like what he did at the Oscars is nothing more and nothing less than Will's mom. Many artists, people who have worked with him, and in this case, even family, have commented that Will has never been a violent person or one characterized by hitting or assaulting others. So we all wonder, what really happened? What were the real motives for Will to slap Chris Rock in front of millions? Was it the bad joke that Rock made, or could it be that Jada is behind all this? Stay to find out. Everybody was checking to make sure he wasn't having a manic yeah. Uh, moment. Because yeah. it's that's not what he's known for, smacking of people course. and doing stuff. Yeah. As many have said, the slap that Will Smith gave Chris Rock simply left them stunned. Nobody expected it, least of all from an actor who's known for always being level-headed and opting for dialogue and not violence. Will Smith had a rough night at the Oscars, even though he won an award for his role in the movie King Richard. The night just didn't go the way everyone had planned. What really happened? The Oscars are known for the surprise aspect of their prizes, nominations, films, and red carpet. But there was more to this year's ceremony than lovely dresses and winners. Things appeared to have gotten hot, and Will Smith was the star of the action. It was undoubtedly something that neither the guests nor the onlookers could have predicted. Like Chris Rock, who was the presenter, remarked, Greatest night in the history of television. One of the most impacting moments of the 94th Academy Awards was Will Smith slapping Chris Rock after the comedian made a joke about his wife. I'm sure that wasn't on anyone's Oscar bingo card. After the comedian made a joke about the actor's wife while presenting the best documentary trophy at the Oscars, Will Smith stormed on stage and smacked Chris Rock in the face in an apparently unscripted gesture that startled viewers and audience members alike. The smack that was televised around the world perplexed us all. Rock made a joke about Will Smith's wife, actress Jada Pinkett Smith, who looked like she belonged in G.I. Jane 2 while on stage to give the best documentary prize. Pinkett Smith has confessed that she suffers from alopecia, a hair loss disorder, and his comment looked to be a swipe at her short hair. Jada Pinkett Smith immediately rolled her eyes at the joke. Last year, Pinkett Smith opened up about her alopecia in an Instagram video detailing the progression of her hair loss. Smith, who appeared to be laughing at the time, was the focus of the camera. The joke, on the other hand, was received with cold applause, prompting Rock to claim, that was a wonderful one. Clearly, this was an offensive joke, but it was nonetheless laughed at by the general public. Smith rose and walked over to Rock, slapping him on the cheek. Smith quickly returned to his seat and told Rock, using expletives, to not talk about his wife. The attendees' look suggested that they were taken back and confused about whether what they just witnessed was a spectacle or a real incident. After the incident, spectators and visitors were at a loss for what to do or say. The entire situation threw a cloud over the awards and the event. When Amy Schumer, one of the hosts, grabbed the microphone again later in the evening, she stated, there's like a different vibe in here. Everyone assumed that Will Smith's motivation to slap Rock was the fury of witnessing that his wife was being part of a bad joke, and above all, of a subject that he knew was sensitive for her. And perhaps it was. But many fans began to speculate that Will was not alone in this, and that the one who'd made this happen was none other than Jada. Could it be that Jada was the one who told Will to slap him? Evidently, during Rock's joke, Jada was upset, and it can be seen when she rolled his eyes while Rock was on stage. We can all agree that Jada was very upset by the comedian's bad joke, and we can't blame her. Jada has been through a lot over the last few years with the issue of her alopecia. Jada Pinkett Smith was open about her alopecia issues long before Chris Rock dragged out her bald head at the 2022 Oscars. Pinkett Smith has been candid about her hair loss struggles since she revealed her diagnosis with the autoimmune disease alopecia on her Facebook watch show, Red Table Talk, in 2018. Turbans and hair covers, as well as cutting her hair short, have helped the actress acclimate to the shift. When my hair is wrapped, I feel like a queen, she said. Pinkett Smith went on to add that she had every kind of test done to determine what was causing her hair loss, but the results were inconclusive. In an Instagram video from the same year, she stated that she was experimenting with small steroid injections to delay her hair loss, which she's since removed. They seem to be helping, but not curing, but they seem to be helping, but I'm open to other ideas, she told her fans at the time. In July 2021, she revealed a new buzz cut inspired by her daughter. After a few months, she gave another update on her hair loss, pointing out a completely bald spot on the top of her head. 
The Matrix Resurrections actress also joked about putting rhinestones on her head and making herself a little crown, which she did in a big way at the 2022 Critics' Choice Awards, where she donned a $46,250 Jackie Aish headdress adorned with 53 diamonds. So among all the drama, it seems like the real culprit in all of this wasn't really Will Smith, as he was just trying to make Jada feel better by listening to her advice to slap rock. Surprisingly, Jada might have more control over Will than we were all aware of, but had Jada thought of the consequences her husband was going to face by making him do this? Probably not. Well, it seems that what's coming for Will is not promising. According to a letter, Academy President David Rubin and CEO Don Hudson are working on a decision about Smith's appropriate conduct, which could take a few weeks. According to the letter, the process will be conducted in a timely and courteous manner for all parties involved while adhering to the Academy's values. Will Smith's move on stage, according to Whoopi Goldberg, a member of the Academy's board of directors, will have huge implications. The Academy issued the following statement. The Board of Governors today initiated disciplinary proceedings against Mr. Smith for violations of the Academy's standards of conduct, including inappropriate physical contact, abusive or threatening behavior, and compromising the integrity of the Academy. After his stand-up show in Boston the day after the Oscars, Smith apologized to Rock, and the comedian stated that he's still processing what happened. Violence in all of its forms is poisonous and destructive. My behavior at last night's Academy Awards was unacceptable and inexcusable. Jokes at my expense are a part of the job, but a joke about Jada's medical condition was too much for me to bear, and I reacted emotionally. Will published in an Instagram post, I would like to publicly apologize to you, Chris. I was out of line and I was wrong. I am embarrassed and my actions were not indicative of the man I want to be. There is no place for violence in a world of love and kindness, he finished. The Academy's board has the authority to suspend or expel members who violate the code of conduct or undermine the integrity of the institution. However, the actor chose to foreshadow this decision by making one that was a bit more contentious. Following his public apology, Smith resigned from the Academy, and many people were left wondering what this meant for the actor's future. What does this mean for Will, though? What exactly is the Academy, and why do individuals desire to join it? The board now boasts 10,000 members who represent 17 different elements of the film industry, including authors, actors, makeup artists, and public relations. Members of the Academy have several benefits, including the chance to vote for those nominated in their branch, as well as vote for Best Picture. They also get initial access to the nominated film's screenings. Even if the actor's prize was not taken away, or at least that's what is believed, the incident may have harmed Will's career very badly as an actor due to negative publicity, which may prompt production companies and committees for new projects and films to refuse to work with him. So could it be that Jada was simply willing to sacrifice her husband's career as long as the comedian who made a bad joke about her was punished? Fans have taken to social media to support Will and even comment on Jada's attitude. But after everything we've told you, what do you think? Could it be that Jada really forced Will to do what he did? Or could it be that Will is just using Jada as an excuse not to face the consequences? Tell us your theories and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any details about your favorite celebrities. Thanks for watching and see you next time.